Hey there, folks. I am Kenny. Welcome back to my channel. Today, I've got a mind-boggling tale to share with you. It's all about Emperor Ming's Ghost Soldiers, a legendary force that sent shivers down the spines of their enemies. These soldiers were said to possess supernatural powers and fought with an eerie ferocity. But were they really ghosts or just cleverly disguised warriors? Join me on this captivating journey as we unravel the truth behind the Ghost Soldiers and explore the fascinating story of Emperor Ming's reign. So sit back, relax, and let's dive into the captivating world of Chinese history. Once upon a time in the land of Song, there was a rotund and jolly emperor named Lu Yu, better known as Emperor Ming of Song. Now, Lu Yu wasn't always the ruler of the land. In fact, he had quite a rough start. The previous emperor, fearing that Lu Yu would pose a threat to his throne, cunningly detained him when he entered the palace. To add insult to injury, due to Lu Yu's plump figure, he was mockingly dubbed the Pig King and subjected to relentless humiliation. There were even several attempts on his life. But fate works in mysterious ways, my friend. As luck would have it, the reigning emperor met his demise during a period of internal strife, and Lu Yu was unexpectedly thrust into the seat of power. And so, he became the seventh emperor of the Lu Song dynasty. During his six and a half years of rule, Emperor Ming faced numerous rebellions across the land. The government had to constantly dispatch troops to quell the uprisings, slowly draining the nation's strength. Despite these challenges, historical accounts describe Emperor Ming as a gentle and benevolent ruler with a deep love for literature. However, as he grew older, he developed a sense of paranoia and began to harbor suspicions towards others. This led to cruel punishments inflicted upon members of the royal family and high-ranking officials. Additionally, he frequently initiated wars, depleting the treasury while indulging in extravagant luxuries. Alas, his excessive spending and misguided decisions took a toll on the once prosperous Lu Song dynasty. The decline of the nation's fortunes mirrored the decline of Emperor Ming's reign. Now, I will tell you the story about how ghost soldiers helped Emperor Ming of Song. In the tumultuous reign of Emperor Ming of Song, the land was plagued by rebellions and uprisings. Emperor Ming, despite his newfound status, lacked confidence and carried a vial of poison at his side, ready to end his life if all hope was lost. It was only through the unwavering loyalty and bravery of his devoted soldiers that he had not become a ghostly figure beneath the blade of his enemies. But just as Emperor Ming's rule seemed on the verge of collapse, a miraculous event occurred. Legend has it that he enlisted the help of a supernatural army known as the Ghost Soldiers, a force of 3,000 spirits of deceased soldiers from the Eastern Jin Dynasty, led by the renowned General Su Jun. These spectral warriors had an eerie pallor, and under the cover of darkness, they launched a fearsome assault on the rebel forces. With bone-chilling cries that sent shivers down the spines of their enemies, the ghost soldiers proved invulnerable to conventional weapons. With their assistance, Emperor Ming swiftly crushed the rebellions that had threatened his reign. And just as mysteriously as they had appeared, the ghost soldiers vanished without a trace. To honor the extraordinary contributions of the ghost soldiers, Emperor Ming issued a decree to recognize the valor of General Su Jun. He ordered the construction of a grand temple known as the Su General Temple, in tribute to the fallen hero. This remarkable tale is recorded in the official history of the Lu Song dynasty, known as the Book of Song. It even mentions that before their campaign, Emperor Ming's loyal soldiers made a pact with an effigy of Su Jun, forming a brotherhood with the departed general. After successfully quelling the rebellions, Emperor Ming affectionately referred to Su Jun as his big brother and expressed his gratitude for the assistance rendered. 
The story of the Ghost Soldiers and their alliance with Su Jun remains a fascinating chapter in the annals of history, showcasing the unexpected alliances and supernatural elements that played a role in the Lu Song dynasty's struggle for stability and power. Ah, let me enlighten you with the true story behind the mysterious ghost soldiers that Emperor Ming of Song supposedly used to quell the rebellions. Were they really ghosts? Of course not. According to unofficial historical records, there's a different tale to be told. Back in the day, General Su Jun had ambitions of his own and attempted to seize power. He had a plan to form a special force called the Mute Soldier Battalion. Secretly, he gathered all the equipment needed for this battalion. However, his plan was foiled when he suffered a defeat, leading to the cancellation of the project. Yet, all the equipment for the Mute Soldier Battalion remained hidden away, and a treasure map marked with the location of these hidden treasures was made. This treasure map was secretly passed down through the generations of one of Su Jun's soldiers. Eventually, it ended up in the hands of a descendant who presented it to Emperor Ming. The Emperor wasted no time and ordered a search for the hidden arsenal depicted in the map. To their surprise, they found everything intact in a hidden cave. Emperor Ming then decided to recruit a group of strong young men from impoverished families, offering them high wages. Once selected, these brave men had to sign a life-or-death contract and consume a special mute-inducing potion. These selfless recruits, known as the Mute Soldiers, would paint their faces with ash before each battle and wear custom-made white rot ten armor, along with the leftover uniforms from the Eastern Jin Dynasty that Su Jun had left behind. This clever disguise made them appear as if they were the legendary Ghost Soldiers of the Eastern Jin Dynasty. The white rot ten armor was actually arrow-resistant, leading to the misconception that they were invulnerable. During battles, the mute soldiers would each carry a whistle specially crafted by Su Jun himself. They would blow these whistles, producing eerie and mournful sounds that resembled the cries of ghosts and howling wolves. Taking advantage of the terror it caused, the mute soldiers launched their attacks under the cover of darkness, leaving their already frightened enemies bewildered and defeated. So, my friend, the truth behind the ghost soldiers is that they were not supernatural beings but a courageous group of mute soldiers. Ah, let me shed some light on the fate of the ghost soldiers, that enigmatic force that mysteriously vanished after quelling the rebellions. Legend has it that to protect this secret, Emperor Ming of Song ordered the drowning of all 3,000 ghost soldiers. However, the true story behind General Su Jun and his treasure map, as well as the fate of the ghost soldiers, lacks detailed documentation in official historical records, leaving room for speculation on its authenticity. Nevertheless, the official history does mention Emperor Ming expressing gratitude to Su Jun, subtly acknowledging the existence of the ghost soldiers. But did ghosts really aid Emperor Ming? I highly doubt it. It's more likely that a large group of soldiers disguise themselves as ghosts to frighten the enemy and gain a military advantage. However, the official records remain silent about the ghost soldiers, perhaps indicating Emperor Ming's efforts to conceal the truth behind this force. One can surmise that Emperor Ming had these soldiers eliminated to protect the secret of the ghost soldiers. It's important to note that these soldiers not only instilled fear in the enemy but also served as a divine endorsement of Emperor Ming's rule, bolstering his legitimacy as a ruler. Therefore, the true identity and the underlying truth behind the ghost soldiers must never be revealed. So, my friend, while the ghost soldiers may have been a clever ruse, they played a crucial role in securing Emperor Ming's power and maintaining the stability of his reign. The truth behind their existence and their ultimate fate may forever remain shrouded in mystery, adding an intriguing layer to the historical tapestry. Hey there, folks. That wraps up today's video on the fascinating story of Emperor Ming's Ghost Soldiers. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did sharing it with you. Before we part ways, I'd like to kindly ask for your support by subscribing to my YouTube channel and giving this video a thumbs up. Your support is what keeps me motivated to create more content, 
delving into the depths of Chinese history, culture, and artistic treasures. So, what topics would you like to hear about next? Drop me a comment and let me know. Thank you so much, and until next time, take care.